Hey, what's going on guys? Welcome back to another video on the channel. In today's video, I will be talking about if GTA 5 is worth your money. Now, you can do a lot of things in GTA 5, such as doing the story mode, which I think the story mode is amazing. The character personalities are cool. Now, in this video, I will be talking about what you can do in G story mode and what you can do in online. If you guys want to check out the online version, here is a timestamp on the video. So you can just skip to the online version. But sorry for wasting your guys' time. And let's get straight into it. First off, we got the story mode. What you can do... Oh, sorry. We can do... A, you could do a lot of things in story mode. Uh, you can buy guns, buy vehicles, buy uh, military vehicles such as a tank and way more stuff. Anyways, you can do the story mode and earn money to buy a lot of cool things. There are a lot of amazing GTA 5 characters such as Lamar, Michael, Trevor, and Franklin. Now, Michael and Trevor and Franklin are the three main characters in story mode, which make the game, makes the game so amazing. You can switch between uh, these characters and sometimes... You get a cutscene of them doing something. For example, Michael might have a f family problem cutscene, but don't worry, the cutscenes aren't that long. Now in the story, now in story mode, there are certain activities such as the strip club. Uh, you can go ghost hunting, you can play tennis, and you can go to a Ferris wheel. And once again, you can go buy weapons, go buy uh, amazing items such as vehicle, and you can also uh, and you could also go to the uh, Ferris wheel, and there is also a cool roller coaster, and much, much, much more. The game has so much to offer, guys. I definitely recommend buying it. Um, now the story mode might take a total of 11 hours to complete if you want to do it in a day, which makes GTA 5 even more worth your money because there is so many missions. It's insane. Now there are way more things you can do in story mode, but I'm going to have to go over to GTA 5 online. But if you do want a story mode part 2, let me know in the comment section below and like this video. It will really uh, help me out. But enough, you know, promoting. Let's get straight into the next. Oh yeah, one more thing. Uh, you can also be in director mode such as like... If you guys are looking at the video right now, the gameplay, uh, I'm in director mode. There's something called director mode where you can do anything you want. You can uh, make your bullets flammable. You can super jump, as you guys just saw. You can also make yourself, um, like, not immortal, so no one can kill you. You can uh, determine if you can get a 5-star wanted level, a 4-star, 3-star, 2-star, what 1-star. And you can also change the day of time. You can uh, explode the bullet. You guys can see the interaction menu right now. Uh, there's explosive melees, super jumps, slidey cars. There's low gravity. There are so many things you can do in director mode. You can also add clips to make a cool movie type thing. Uh, you, yeah, as you guys can see, it's just so cool. You, and if, if you own any cars, uh, then you can definitely just spawn them in. And... Any g what guns or weapons you have unlocked will go straight into your inventory in director mode, uh, which is just so much cool. Like it's just so cool, so you don't have to like download mods, potentially get a virus, uh, which no one likes uh, viruses. Uh, but yeah, let's get straight into the online version of story mode. Now guys, what really makes GTA 5 a really unique game is its multiplayer. GTA Online is a very huge platform with lots of players and a lot of missions. It, it has a lot of attention from Rockstar. And even you can even receive a lot of DLCs since its release. And there are missions for anyone. You want heist? You can make heist, guys. <laughs> you like racing? There is a ton of racing. You, you like PvP missions? Well, you got it. You can kill NPCs. Uh, for the missions you can kill other players um you do you want a bigger score you got it all that yeah, yeah if you want to play gta 5 online and don't know if it's worth it well here are a bunch of activities you could also do you can go to the strip club obviously you can get a submarine you can fly plane airplanes you can arm wrestle with friends steal cars watch a movie 
live, feed, house, buy houses, play golf with friends, steal cars, go on a joy ride, and much more. You can complete all all in rewards. You can also get so many rewards from GTA 5. You can buy a warehouse, uh, buy a bicycle. Uh, you can go bounty hunting, max out all of your um, online character uh, skill, play sports, defend other players' um, cargos. Now the downside of the downside of GTA 5 guys is grinding, and GTA 5 is pretty difficult. It's sometimes if you don't have a group of friends to play missions with, or at least one you will have a bad taste in your mouth because of cheaters and tryhards tryhards are those type of players which uh got pretty much everything in the game and they are bored so they enjoy hunting and killing new players which i hated when i started and they do it for fun uh now the tryhard type player is kind of me so i'm sorry um you can also oh, also you guys can also buy a lot of businesses you can you can buy business earn profit uh, you can buy vehicles, all that jazz. Uh, so making business is pretty m impossible on the session. Other than that, standard missions and racing and everything else is pretty much awesome. Uh, now if you guys do want a part two, uh, to the series, I don't know if I should make it a series. But, if you guys do want a, uh, you know, part two on story mode online, just let me know in the comment section below or leave a like so I know uh, if I should make an online or story mode. But, yeah guys, I did miss some stuff. I, d I did miss some uh, stuff that you could do in story mode and online. I just wanted to keep the video very short and simple for you guys. Um, but yeah, if you guys do want this to be a series once again, please leave a like and subscribe. Uh, I really do enjoy doing these type of stuff. I just don't like it to be that long because I do understand how it feels like or what it feels like to make videos like these and, you know, watch them and then, like, you know, it takes forever. But, yeah, guys, I hope you guys enjoy. Leave a like and subscribe. And I'll see you guys in the next video. I guess peace. And yeah, I'm trying to hit 200 subs. So if you guys, you know, who want me to hit 200 subs and make, I will be really happy. I really will. Uh, I will make a 12-hour live stream on uh, the 200 sub special or 24-hour live stream if you guys like that. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoy. Leave a like, subscribe, and subscribe. Peace out. Bye.